Hey there, folks. Today I'm thrilled to take you on a journey like no other. We find ourselves at Shinosaka Station, and let me tell you, it's a day to remember. I'm all suited up and ready to roll because we're about to hop aboard the magnificent Twilight Mizukaze, a luxury train worth a jaw-dropping $6,000. Yep, you heard that right, and I promise you it's going to be worth every penny. Welcome to Wealthbound, the ultimate destination for all things opulent and lavish. Whether you're an aspiring affluent individual or simply fascinated by the finer things in life, Wealthbound is here to heighten your senses and enchant you with the epitome of luxury. And guess what? I'm not alone on this adventure. I've got none other than my mum joining me today, and we're both equally excited about what lies ahead. Hooray! Now if you're not familiar with the Twilight Misukaze, no worries. It's one of Japan's top-tier trains, standing proudly alongside the Trans Sweet Shikishima and the Kyushu Nanatsuboshi. But here's the kicker. We didn't just stumble upon this experience, we won a lottery-based ticket for this extravagant voyage, and guess what? We'll be sharing this exclusive ride with just 30 other lucky passengers. So buckle up, relax, and join us as we embark on this remarkable two-day, 550-kilometer journey. There's a lot in store for us, but before we dive in, let me introduce you to the star of the show, the Twilight Mizukaze. Trust me, you won't want to miss it. It's a ten-car masterpiece, three cars larger than the renowned seven-star luxury train. And the best part? It's green, giving it a unique charm that's akin to riding a fancy zucchini. I must admit I'm buzzing with excitement as we start this adventure. As we step inside, you'll be greeted by an interior designed to perfection, with verdant green and light wood tones creating a soothing and sophisticated ambience. Our room, 901, is a royal twin room, one of just 15 on the train. It's a feast for the eyes. The bathroom is sleek and there are two sofa beds, a power outlet, Bluetooth speakers, glass cups and even a trip destroyer button. Oh, and there's Wi-Fi on board, enough to stream YouTube videos. How cool is that? We also have some fun surprises like the Mizukaze mask and other welcome gifts. Hooray! And let's not forget our zebra friend. In our room there's a fridge stocked with local beverages, including aromatic tea. We've got a rack with some intriguing items, like big hangers that cost a whopping dollar three hundred each. And speaking of expenses, there's even a Hermes shampoo. Fancy, right? The bathroom boasts a rain shower and a chair. Very thoughtful. Oh, and there's another Toto toilet, because why not? That's a wrap for our room tour. Now onto our welcome drink. I initially thought it was grape juice, but it turns out it was all part of the plan. There are also some delightful welcome gifts, including chocolate biscuits and a tablet device to keep us updated on train events. You can even place orders from a menu offering cocktails, whiskey, beer and more. I couldn't resist trying another drink myself. You can also explore train maps and location guides to make the most of your journey. And don't forget the online boutique where you'll find some rather luxurious items like a $400 cloth thing and $350 cups. Talk about luxury. Now let's embark on a tour of the train. We're starting with Car 1, which features an observatory lounge area with impressive domed glass windows. It's truly a sight to behold. So, picture this. We're on an incredible journey, and guess what? There's a surprise waiting for us. We're talking about an observation deck, and it's got me super intrigued. Can you feel the excitement? Oh, but it's a bit chilly out here. I bet it's a whole different experience in spring and summer, don't you think? Now let's talk about these fancy cars on our train. Cars 2 and 3? Yep, they're the Royal Twin. But hold on, car 4 is something else. It's the Universal Royal Twin and Royal Single. Right on time, we roll into Okayama. This is where the Sunrise Express takes a little break. But we've got some cool stuff on board. Car 5, that's the lounge car, perfect for relaxing or sipping a drink at the bar. And don't forget car six, that's the dining car. It's got this striking monochromatic look. Guess what? Dinner's happening right here and let me tell you about car seven. This isn't your typical room, it's the whole suite. I'm pretty sure it's bigger than my house and get this, it costs $13,000 per night. Now, on to cars eight and nine, also royal twin rooms for guests. And then there's car 10, the last car, and it has another observatory lounge. It's the train driver. Yep, there's an observatory here too. Now let's head back to my room. Fast forward a bit, we're on a mini trip to Kurashiki. Check this out, there's something on my desk and it's from Santa. It's a heat pack, perfect for the cold weather. We've arrived at Kurashiki, known for its historic district with traditional Japanese architecture and picturesque canals. But hold on, that's not the historic district, it's the Mizukaze bus. And guess what? 
I got a Walkman. Now we're off to the O'Hara Museum of Art. The Mizukaze passengers get exclusive access, and this place showcases Western art by Monet, Picasso, and Renoir. Unfortunately, no cameras allowed, so I'll catch up with you in an hour. Back on the train, I've got to say, that museum was fascinating and very artistic, wouldn't you agree? Oh, and there's a koi fish, too. Time for a quick rest and a small snack. The time has come for us to return to the train station. Let us retreat to our headquarters in the meantime. Behold, the bed has been unveiled before us. They even provided pillows and pajamas. We've got two options, Wizukaze or Mizukaze. I'm sticking with Wizukaze. Our dinner reservation is at 2015, but it's still 1745. Let's find something to do while we wait. Back at the observatory deck, we've got the perfect view of the setting sun. Well, it's already set, but the view is still breathtaking. But wait, should I eat before dinner? I mean, why not? I've got some nuts, raisins, and crackers to munch on. It's dark out now, and it's finally dinner time. Pub time. Or so you thought. Get tricked. I'm actually at the lounge. It's time for the pub time. I got myself wine. Or so you thought. Get tricked. It's actually grape juice. Holy smokes. This is the holy grail of grape juice. What is this? Perfected grape juice? Something just started. It's a mini orchestra. It is time. Dinner, Michelin three star. Look at that. Got my tie on for this occasion. and please share your thoughts or any questions you might have in the comments below. I love hearing from you. Until next time, stay curious, stay adventurous, and keep exploring this beautiful world we live in. Thanks for joining me, and I'll see you on the next journey. Take care.